Hi everyone, I'm JD. Welcome back to my channel. So we're up to day 26 of the March Daily Journal Challenge and just got my process here and I'm using a card for this page spread. And that first card that I show, there's a story behind that one and it ties into what I journal about this day. So I'll share about that as, um, as you watch this process video. Here is just a stash of cards that I have that I thought I might want to use one of these. And so basically the story was when I was in Melbourne and I went to an op shop, I just grabbed a bunch of cards. So I went to the card section, section, rummaged through them and grabbed a handful. I think there were about five cards. So I didn't really even look at what I had. Went to buy the other things that I had as well. Um, there were some books and some papers and with them the cards. So when I got home, I didn't even check. I just put them aside. And then when I came back to Bowen, and I was unpacking everything, uh, just going through all my things I got from the op shop, I picked up this plain white envelope and it was kind of not sealed, but you know how it, the flap goes underneath the envelope type thing. And I was looking at it going, I don't recognize this envelope. And I pulled it out um, and pulled the flap out and I saw this card and like, I, I, I don't remember this card. <laughs> where, where, where was this card? Where's this card from? And it was that card there, just think about the way Jesus honors you and smile. And I'm thinking, oh my gosh, did I just take someone's card? What, what happened here? Um, and because, yeah, this card slipped out from somewhere, so it wasn't with the other pile at this time when I picked it out uh, as I was unpacking. And so I'm like, oh my gosh, I just took someone's card. <laughs> I thought I took, because I stayed with my sister at her house when I was in Melbourne, so I thought maybe... I picked up the card accidentally from the desk or the table when I was packing or something. Anyway, so I open up the card and there is a $50 note in it. And now I'm really going, oh my gosh, I just stole someone's money. <laughs> Not only did I steal someone's card, I stole someone's money. But I read the card and it was addressed to a name I had no idea who it was for. And um, the message didn't make any sense. And I rang my sister and just asked her straight away, uh, did I take a card? Did you have a card from this person? Da, 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 da. And she's like, no, no, that's not ours. And she just said to me, um, I think God has just blessed you in this moment. <laughs> and I think you just now have, have a gift of $50. And yeah, it was just a really crazy moment because yeah, I was just so wanting to, wanting to make sure that I didn't take this from someone else, first of all. And then having this realization that this card came into my life and this random $50. But not only that, it was the card, what it says, just think about the way Jesus honors you and smile. And inside the card, it had written, like on the actual card card, it had written, you are so loved, so valued, uh, and something else. And then there was a, a scripture verse as well. And I thought, oh my goodness, this is just so fitting. I felt God speaking to me in this moment. And what it, it really had this, um, yeah, it was a significant moment for me. And I felt God just saying to me, I'm trustworthy, I'm in control, I'm your provider. And this is a moment you can look back to any time that you may worry or anything like that. And just you can always know that I'll provide for you because look how this happened. Um, like I wasn't in need or anything of $50 at the time and he was just saying hey I can work through random people and random places and random times who knows when this card happened who knows when this was put in there and I am God I'm a genius I'm in control I see all things and can make all things come together at exactly the right timing the perfect timing to bring anything you need or any gift that I want to give you into your life at the right time that I want to give it to you and I was just like wow because can you imagine the amount of steps that things had to happen for me to get this card you know a complete stranger writing this card um the amount of time that that card might have been in the op shop, I'm guessing they gave this card to the person and the person didn't even open it. Um, and then when they were going to the op shop, they dropped off a bunch of cards or something and that card was just among it. And then all the number of people who went to the op shop, however many years that card has been there, and all the people who overlooked that card. And to me, just randomly, not even looking, just completely randomly just grabbing a bunch and taking it off with me and then finally I'm just unpacking and randomly opening it up and here's this card 
everything is this gift so yeah it just showed me god is in control he can provide in miraculous ways so even if in the natural it's just looking like oh my gosh how is how is this ever going to be okay and what's going to happen and things aren't looking good god can he can just make things happen in such random miraculous ways and who knows he could have had all that orchestrated just for that one moment to teach me that lesson i don't know who knows you know um and so yeah, it was just this moment of like yes you can trust me and i am provider and even if it doesn't look like in the natural that provision's coming just trust me i can do anything and work things together and do anything and i hope this is an encouragement to anyone out there as well like um god is all of our provider and not only does he just provide our needs he also goes beyond that and just blesses us for no reason other than he just loves us and delights in us and all that kind of thing he smiles at us and yeah so my sister also said to me when i when i was on the phone to her she just said i pray that every day this year is filled with moments like this little random moments of gifts like this and so yeah that was really sweet anyway back to this page spread so i stuck on this card and decorated it with a bit of washi tape at the bottom and now i'm just doing some journaling here about the great mysterious the great unknown and how uh yeah i guess that whole idea of how i was a bit freaking out about going full-time with willowbound journals and just thinking have i made a big mistake is this silly um all that kind of stuff and then that moment you know where god just gave me this amazing gift with this card it just reminded me again no wait god is trustworthy and he's my provider and i don't have to fret or be frantic or fear or be anxious and um yeah so i'm just writing about that here um going into the unknown when you step into the unknown it can be scary um but yeah just to know god i can trust my god in the unknown and so the water the picture on the card is water it's kind of uh, it's really pretty but it's kind of a bit dark and a bit um chaotic i suppose and that's what water is kind of like it's chaos the watery chaos and so it's just a good picture to remind me about the great mysterious the great unknown it's a beautiful thing it's not a dark scary thing but to see it as a beautiful journey and a beautiful adventure and to see just when you go into the unknown it's a chance to see god show up um and show up he does <laughs> in a glorious way in the unknown so yeah i'm just writing about this how god is there looking after all of us and i guess even now in this time you know how life is looking a bit different at the moment with all that's going on in the world at the moment and it can seem and look like in the physical it's just unknown it's mysterious and a good reminder as well is you know god's not surprised by this to him it isn't the unknown to him it's not the mysterious he's still in control he this is no surprise to him and he can still provide and be trustworthy and look after us and loves us and smiles on us even in crazy times or in times where we're in the unknown for him it's not unknown so i just love that um and yeah the mysterious the great unknown it is yeah those times where we can see him show up that idea that god is mysterious too god is kind of unknown cuz he's just so unfathomable and all that kind of thing and yet he shows himself to us he reveals himself to us in day-to-day moments in our lives in big ways and small ways he showed himself to me with that card and he will show himself to us in all times um and maybe especially the crazy chaotic messy dark unknown mysterious times um it's yeah just kind of fun i suppose to think of the ways that he can show who he is to us um in these surprising miraculous ways <laughs> um and yeah so just decorating this page and i can't really read what i wrote on this page in that small writing what looking at this screen but yeah just god is a genius is that what it says he's in control and yeah i can't read any more than that because my screen covers it where i'm recording but anyway um just hope it's super encouraging this page but and also as i was decorating this page 
I've got some washi tape at the bottom as well and there's blue hearts and there's some stars and I thought that was a good combination the stars represent kind of the great mysterious the great unknown and how God is like that he's the great mysterious he's the great unknown but the hearts how we don't have to be afraid of him or afraid of mysterious times because he is love and he shows love to us in all times maybe even um, especially we can feel his love in those times where it is um, the unknown and yeah I love how it kind of all ties in that seaweed washi tape that thick washi tape on the card is also representative of the water the great chaos the watery unknown the great mysterious so that's how all of this ties in here um, yeah so that's the story for <laughs> this page spread um, and I was also thinking of putting it here so see that kind of see-through page um, I love that page so much and I wanted to put that on top of this card so that it's, the card shows through to the other page and it just works really well I think it looks very effective so yeah that's my page <laughs>